everyone. Welcome to your art lesson for today. Today we will be doing some projects around pointillism. Pointillism is an art style that started in the late 1800s that involves using a series of small dots connected to create a larger image. In this lesson, I will show you some examples. I will show you how to set up your workstation and what materials you need, as well as a quick tutorial. Let's get our supplies gathered and get started. Before we get to making, I wanted to show you all some references on how artists have used pointillism in their work. Notice how the dots on the screen are being used, what colors the artists have chosen, how far apart and how large those dots are. If you're interested in learning more about how artists have used pointillism, I will make sure to provide a link on the online form. Consider some of the elements in these paintings when thinking about the images you will be creating for class today. At your workstation, you're going to need pencil, eraser, paper, and markers. You can use another type of drawing utensil, but this is what I'm using for the tutorial. Before we start working on our own images, I want you to practice pointillism on a geometric shape. Start by drawing out the outline of that shape and beginning to fill it in with dots. Notice what happens whenever you put a lot of dots in one area or none in another part of the shape. Don't be afraid to experiment during this time. Play around with using more than one color, spacing out the dots differently, or layering more than one color over each other. Continue to edit this geometric shape or do more than one until you feel ready to start your project. Now you can either decide to do your own sketch, which you see me doing here, or you can choose a pre-selected image. Take some time here to pause the video and do a sketch or get your images. Once you're ready to start drawing, begin by picking out your colors and outlining the parts of your image with that color. Notice how I'm not using any lines, only a series of small dots. These dots will start light but begin to get darker as I layer them. Notice how small the dots are. If you choose to use a larger marker or a different material, your dots may look different than mine. Think about how they are being spaced out on the image, if you have areas of white space, or areas where there are more dots than others. Another technique to try is layering different colors over one another to create a different effect. Notice as I'm creating a sunset, how the colors are layering upon one another to create more of a fade. As you begin to fill up your paper, remember to always edit. Are there any changes you can be making to the image? More colors you can use? Once you reach a stopping point, celebrate your victory. You have officially done a pointillism drawing. Consider doing this again in your independent work choices. And for now, keep making art. 